in the red. This crowd is ready for Haji Eliyev. A guy you're extremely familiar yeah. with, wrestled yeah. him on multiple occasions, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, two times wrestled him in European Championships. Great wrestler, uh, extremely explosive, good outside single, especially when you put that underhook inside. And something new to mention. Oh, one second here. Haji of with that right knee heavily taped, that taped. was not there earlier. That was not there earlier. His left knee's got more tape on it as well. Both knees heavily taped him. If you recall, he did have that blue tape surrounding the kneecaps yeah. on both knees earlier. And then on the left eye, he was cut, but he continues to rub his right eye. Yeah, I think he got um, a poke in the eye right at the beginning then. So the dive also apologized as they always do, give his hands, said sorry, but. That's 32-year-old Haji Aliyev out of Azerbaijan. The resume. We have four minutes and 54 seconds, and we could take that entire time to go over the resume of Haji Aliyev, but we'll just go quick with the Tokyo Olympic silver medal, the Rio Olympic bronze medal, three world titles, becoming the first ever Azerbaijani wrestler to ever do that. Yep. The only one since then has been Eldon Izazizli, but he's won his titles all at the non-Olympic weight in Greco-Roman at 55 kilos. European titles, four of them for Haji Aliyev, one-time silver medalist at the European Championships, one-time bronze medalist. And on the other end, it's Islam Dudayev wrestling with the blue singlet. First ever Albanian wrestler to win a European title. Most people thought that Abakarov, Zalemhan Abakarov yeah. was the first. It was their first world champion, but Islam Dudayev made history this year, winning that European title. Haji Aliyev now gives up the inactivity clock. Points so Dudayev leads 1-0. Yeah. What do you see from both of these guys in the opening two minutes? Again, just taking it a little bit easier, trying to hand fight a little, see how, we, see how each of them reacts in these situations. Like I said, that one point for Haji Aliyev in this moment's not too important. He's still got three, three minutes, 50 seconds. Nice shot though from Dudayev, head inside, on that bad knee of Haji Aliyev. Yeah, he's you hurt. Can, yeah, you can see a little bit of grimace on his face. He needs to be careful, he needs to be concentrated here, or he's going to give more points away. 3-0 the lead after the takedown for Dudayev. You could see when that shot went in, Hajali have almost grabbed his knee in that sense. Grimacing in pain, clear yeah. on the face for Haji Aliyev. I think they're gonna stop this pretty soon. Looking at that left eye, the blood starting to come out. He did have a white bandage. Around it in his last match, yeah. That is no longer there, it's gone. Doing his best to avoid it, but... Good shot from Haji Aliyev. Needs to keep the pressure going, though. Again, nice shot. Needs to keep up that pace when he starts the second round. Opening three minutes in the book, it's Dudayev leading Aliyev 3-0. Taking a little bit of bleeding time as well, this Haji Aliyev in this moment. Doctors coming running back on. Now, if you're Haji Aliyev now, you really need to set the tone straight from the whistle. He needs to go in, start working his attacks, start being more offensive. He can't give Dudayev any time to try and get his attacks going again, because he will target that bad knee. Yeah, and that bad knee that you see, Haji is normally a right knee dominant yeah. wrestler. How does it, how does it change? You got no, no fingers. fingers called. How does that change the approach from an offensive standpoint? It makes it a lot more difficult, of course. 
Especially if you can't drive on that knee as, as much as you would like to. Hitte Gazimov in the corner of Azerbaijan. The Rio Olympic silver medalist telling Haji, we need you to pick it up. Yeah, we need you to get going. That's what I said, he needs to. Haji Aliyev is great in these kind of fights. He's got a gas tank on him, he can attack and he can attack and he can attack, but he needs to keep that tempo going. Beautiful two points there. Taking him over to his back. Just has to take his time, try and relax. It'll just take a second just to get a breather here. Just calm down a little. One minute 55 in the clock, there's only one point in it. He needs to keep working like this. Beautiful misdirection attack, started left yep. side, came back right, got his hands locked, came up through the middle, finished the shot. The deficit now is one point as Islam Dugayev's 3-0 lead cut, 3-2. After Haji Aliyev picked up that takedown. But he can't wait now. If he, set, if he settles himself again and waits too long, the Dayev will shoot and will attempt to score like he did in the first round. He's got to go. He's got to push the pace a little. So in this moment then, when the Dayev was standing up, he should have attacked. He should have countered it. Should keep going. Nice shot there from Haji Nisa. Power up through the middle like he did before. Try and keep his hands locked in that situation. Not to rush, catches the angle, gets the two. The second takedown of the period gives Haji Ali up the two point lead. And he's lacing him up, he's got his left through, his left hand sliding through. Just needs to take his time, not rushing his position. Try and get, he's going to put the pressure. But the dive with great flexibility though, not giving any points up. Hanging up for dear life, yeah. Haji Aliyev's going for it, he's going to get the two. Take him up the mat. The crowd is going wild in here. Look at his legs, tangled up like a pretzel, but Haji Aliyev gains a three-point advantage with 26 seconds left. The big question is how much energy did he use trying to turn him over there? Can Haji Ali have hold on now? 23 seconds on the clock. God, keep away from that underhook. Keep compact, keep his elbows inside. Stay off his knees in this position. Don't stay there, he's got to get to his feet. Short time. 